Hello, this is Gary at Jack Raven Bushcraft. Thank you for watching our video. Uh, this week I'm going to show you how to light a fire using a loop. In case you're wondering what a loop is, this is a loop. So it is uh, kind, of a, it's kind of like a magnifying um, glass type thing. So I carry one of these around with me because I, um, I'm interested in, particularly in, in botany. And so sometimes when I'm looking at plants, I might want to look at the, 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 the stamens. I might, might want to look at the, the sepals. I might want to look to see if the uh, if there are hairs on it, these kinds of things. So that sort of tiny microscopic world is endlessly fascinating. And yeah, so uh, to enable me to look at that best, I often will have a loop in my pocket. They're not expensive. I think this was a tenner or something like that. So um, yeah, it's a really useful thing to be carrying around with you um, in the outdoors to help with your with your natural history. So whilst its primary purpose uh, is indeed for me to be able to, to look at tiny things, um, of course I could always use this to start a fire if I were in a um, situation where I didn't have any other means to start a fire with me. So I'm going to demonstrate that now. So I've got a piece of char cloth here. Um, if I didn't have any char cloth, of course I might well be able to wander around and find something like a, a King Alfred's cake that would uh, do the same purpose. So I'm just going to pop it down onto the well, onto the bench here for the time being. And then I just need to bring my loop so that the sun is coming through the loop at uh, 90 degrees. And then I just need to kind of focus that down until I get a tiny little dot on my so it, it's a case of just moving this in closer until the you see a circle and then just kind of keep moving it until that circle becomes a, a very tiny dot and that's uh, that's when the sun's um, energy is kind of focusing down onto that single spot. I've got the sun coming through the, the loop at 90 degrees. Right. And now I'm just going to move that in until I get a little pinprick of light on my char cloth. Like so. And that is a light. So that took a few seconds. Now I just need to pop that into a tinder bundle. And so now this I can uh, place onto the ground, put all my kindling on top of it, and there's my fire. I hope that's something you found useful, something that you can add into your own bushcraft tool set. Um, I will try my best to get some more content out next week. You can make sure you don't miss out on that by subscribing either to our blog or to our YouTube channel, either of which are Jack Raven Bushcraft. In the meantime, take care.